it's Natalia and today I'm gonna to be filming my what I got for Christmas video and I am so excited um, so the first thing I got um, you can probably tell right away because I like kind of set it up differently set this video up differently than usual um, I got studio lights so I'm really excited they're obviously like have them like up so I haven't figured out like what lighting's the best or like what angles the best just yet so like it's probably gonna take me a while to like figure it out and like mess around with it um but I'm so excited so basically I have like the little paper so you guys can see it because like I can't really show you my setup so this is what I got I have like the two little umbrella things and like the smaller tripod and like all that fun stuff so I got the book Jesus Calling which I'm so excited about um, my violin teacher actually recommended this to me, um, and I'm just really excited. I've always wanted to have a devotional book, and now I have two, actually, because I got another one at a Christmas party, um, but I really, really wanted this one, um, so I'm really excited to start reading this as soon as, like, the new year starts. Then, you know you are a YouTuber when you get excited about getting a new hard drive. Um, I've been needing a new one for the longest time. I've been deleting a bunch of stuff every time that I'm filming a new video so I, I can, like, actually film and edit it. Um, but like I really needed a new one and I was gonna buy one on Black Friday but I'm like you know what I'm gonna wait out till Christmas I'm just gonna wait it out it's okay and I've been struggling so much um, but I finally got a new one I'm so excited and it's a four terabyte which wow amazing then I also got a Michael Kors wallet and I'll like bring it up a little bit it's like metallic it's like a silvery brownish color like I don't know what to call it but it's really cute and I'm really excited this was like unexpected like I'm just really excited then I got two fashion design books because as you can tell that's kind of what I'm gonna study in college um, so I got a um, fashion design course so this one and then I got 20 ways to draw a dress which this one my brother gave me so excited excited I also happened to get this blanket which I'm 10 out of 10 very excited about because who doesn't love a new blanket then my grandma is actually spending Christmas with us or spent Christmas with us this year um, from Mexico, so I'm really excited about that. And she got me this fur vest, which I'm like very excited about. How many times have I said very excited in this video? Way too many. I should start like a count. There's probably already a count by the time you're like getting to this part of the video, but you know, I'm excited. Then probably one of my more like awaited gifts. Um, I got, oh my gosh, hold on. Oh, okay. I got this pair of boots and I am so excited because if you saw my Black Friday haul, I got um, like green over the knee boots, like these, um, but I wanted black ones. And like I asked for them for Christmas, which is why I didn't buy them on Black Friday. So I was like, okay, like I know I'm gonna get them, like blah, blah, I'm so excited. Okay, this is a big one. Okay, so um, as I mentioned, I want to go into fashion design, so I sew a lot. Um, and I have been wanting a surging machine for a while and basically what it does it's like all the weird little finishes that you see on your shirts like where it's, it looks like a bunch of like different little stitches like it's usually on the inside like of your like, sleeves or whatever um, that's what it does that's called surging um, and I really wanted a machine that does that because like a regular sewing machine doesn't do that you have to get a special one so I really wanted one because I want to make like my clothes look a little bit more professional and like better well done and whatnot um, so if you got me one and I'm so excited if you follow my vlog channel um, I posted a Chicago um, shopping day vlog thing um, and I said that I basically bought myself a Christmas present because I was like, you know what? It is time to treat yourself, Natalia. So I bought myself a black Michael Kors backpack with like all the gold studs and it looks like this. And I am super excited because, um, I just feel like this is like a nice like traveling backpack. Like it's obviously not, like it's small, it's tiny, but like it fits like my wallet, my like camera, my, um, Phone, like just like the basic necessities like I don't bring a lot of stuff with me when I travel this is much more comfortable than carrying around a purse because like I always wear like um, crossbodies but like those kill my shoulders because like I do put like my camera in my wallet and like that stuff like just gets heavy especially just like the camera in itself um, so like this is just so much more comfortable for me then my brother's girlfriend got me this black leather jacket I'm so excited 
And then my friend Jay, if you guys know him, he got me this little clinic set, um, which has all this stuff in, which I've obviously like already used um, and whatnot. Like this is just the empty box. Like I already put it with my makeup stuff. Um, but I thought I'd show you guys anyway. So then, as you guys probably know, I have a boyfriend, you know, Tyler, yep. Anyway, um, his parents got me, oh my gosh, I just dropped it. Um, I got a Scotty's Brunos gift card from them, so 10 out of 10, totally using that. I'm very excited. Uh, so yes, my boyfriend, Tyler, he got me this, um, so he got me this Kate Spade, like, lanyard, key holder, whatever you want to call it, my shoe. Which looks like a gift. I have my car keys on it already and like my license and everything because he gave it to me like prior to Christmas. So like I've already used it, but um, I'm so excited because I have this really old lanyard that I've been using um, from like Vera Bradley. And I've had it since fifth grade, I'm pretty sure. Um, and like I have been using it since then. And like it's just really old and I don't even like Vera Bradley. Like, it was a gift, but like I just don't, like I'm not a fan of it. It's not like it's ugly or anything, but like I just like, I don't, I don't see why it's so wonderful, except for the fact that it's like long lasting, but um, I didn't really like it that much, like I wanted a new one really badly, um, so I guess I must have said that at some point, and the Kate Spade is like one of my favorites as far as like accessories goes, um, so I'm really excited, and it's like this really nice like purpley color, like, oh, and it's got like a little bow, and let me take out my like license so you guys can see this other part without having to look at my license. But this is what the other side looks like. It says, I'll play no work. It's so cute. I'm so excited. And it's also like helping me like narrow down what I carry because my other one had like a little zipper pouch. So then I would put like a bunch of change in there and like it would just get really heavy. But this one like only has three little card things. So then I keep like my debit, my credit, and like my purity card in there. Um, and that's like all I have, which is so nice. And then I've also narrowed down my keychain so that it would look better. So I only have like the Pope and the Eiffel Tower. And then my keys, obviously. But it's just so great. I'm so excited. So that is all I got for Christmas this year. Um, I'm pretty sure I hope I'm not missing anything because that'd be really awkward. But um, yeah, I hope you guys liked it. Um, I didn't say this earlier, but like obviously not trying to brag. Like I just think it's so fun to share. Like I love seeing other Christmas sweeties and I say this every year, but like honestly, like it's just fun. Um, so that is what I got and let me know what you guys got like comment down below your favorite gift that you got this year or your favorite gift that you gave this year. <gasps> I need to show you my gift my favorite gift that I'm I gave. Where's my phone? My brother really likes Star Wars, right? So um, When we were in Spain over the summer, there's this one scene in Star Wars that was filmed in Seville and let me and, it, and my brother and his girlfriend recreated it when we were there. Oh, and my grandpa. So it looks like this, right? That's like the scene at the bottom and that's like them recreating it. They kind of did the opposite side, but you know, like it happened. So I was like, mm, what could I do? So I decided to edit their picture to look like the actual picture. So it looks like this. And then I got it done on a canvas for him, but it was supposed to come in like yesterday so like the 24th, but then it got really delayed and it's coming in the 28th, so he doesn't have it yet. I don't know if it like turned out okay or not, but I hope so. That's like my most like, uh, I don't know. I'm just really excited. So that is it and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.